Okay. There we go. Oh, into the outer worlds we go. We shall continue, please. Hopefully we can actually load in this time. Because, boy, we didn't get to load in last time after we uh, didn't die. Totally didn't die or anything. Hey, there we go. We're actually back in. Cool. So, if I remember correctly, this was before we killed those two guys in there. Okay. How much didn't we raid, though? I'll do. Now, where am I? I am in. Okay, I am in the the stuff which I was hoping to be in. I don't think there's anything else in here. Ooh. An antique saber. Is that any better than what we got? Or can I even wield it? I guess not. 917. This might look nice in one of the cruise rooms on the Unreliable. Cool. So I picked up something before we meant to pick up something. Fair enough. Now this is where we died, if I remember correctly. You idiot. Flanking.
First aid room key. There we go. Oh, there's nothing. Okay. Worse is up there, though. I'm sure that I probably missed something. What have we got? Weapon parts. Shonen hero! Kill all those filthy capitalist pigs. In the process of doing that, my friend. Kill them all and redistribute the wealth. Hell yeah. That's what I'm here to do. How are you doing, bud? How are you doing? Dervish mist. I don't know what that is, but it sounds cool. To be fair, I don't know what half the stuff does, because I am not used to crafting games, because the last time I played Fallout 4 was literally months ago. Did I not pick up everything in here? That's pretty cool that I can just check out these. They look pretty cool. Boop. A second, is there something through there? Right, so now... Oh, no, we have to go all the way around, don't we? Uh, kind of anxious. Sorry I missed yesterday's stream. It is absolutely fine, my friend. Do not worry. It was... It was a short stream. Today is also probably going to be a shorter stream. An impact hammer. I wonder if I can make the knockout blow. Ah! Stun baton. Pet pills. What does Dervish Mist do? Tell me, game. Huh. Speedy movement speed, melee attack speed. Because there's so many modifiers that I, I don't care for. Hey, Goose, how you doing? Hope you're having a good day. How have you been? I know that Sean was streaming a little earlier. Were you hanging out with him? Just sat down with dinner. Excellent. Sounds like good timing to me. Sounds like good timing. Should we hack this? Mostly lurking though. Oh, cool, cool. What would be on here? Oh my god, we could have just We could we could have just hacked. Cool. Okay. We could we could have just hacked a thing. That's fair. Uh always hack, yeah. Always always do all the things. Uh now where's our 142 DPS? Man, that is much better than that. <laughs> Hundred, 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 hundred. Wow, that sort of shotgun is so much better than this. I love that plasma rifle, honestly. Uh, do we need the pistol? I think the pistol's eh. It's a bit eh. Hopefully this is going to be a bit better than the other pistol that we picked up. Hi, Nora. Uh, but yeah, uh, folks, it doesn't matter who you are, you can use this command. Uh, if you do exclamation mark outer worlds in chat, if you've ever been on, or if you've ever been on the fence, if you've been on the fence of outer worlds and you're thinking, man, I sure would love to buy outer worlds on PC that you can find exclusively on the Epic Store at the moment. Uh, what I, boy, howdy, do I have a deal for you? Uh, through my link, you can save 10%. On Outer Worlds, so its RRP is forty nine ninety nine, uh, at least in the UK, it's forty nine ninety nine pounds, and uh, you can save ten percent on it with uh, with with Green Man Gaming. And on top of that, if you use my link, I get a little bit of commission. So you're helping support me 
as well as supporting Obsidian for making such a pretty game. I'm glad that the enemies haven't respawned. It just it has literally picked up where the autosave was. Also, man, I need to uh, I need to get some energy cartridges or something because this gun's great, but it eats it eats your ammo. It eats your ammo so hard. Now, do I give it to the druggie or to the person who says that they're going to help? And deliver it to people who, who mean it. I think I deliver it to the person who means better. Epic Store exclusive rip. It is coming to Steam. Uh, a year on? I can't remember. Uh, what is the code? What do you mean, what is the code? Oh, exclamation mark, Outer Worlds. There you go. There is no code. You you save 10% just by going to Green Man Gaming. Uh, but the advantage, the, the true advantage of going through that code in particular is if you are going to buy it on PC, then I get a little bit of commission for you using the link. Also, you save money by going through Green Man Gaming. Green Man Gaming. Gaming. This, I'm pretty sure that's not their, their slogan, but gaming, that's green. There you go. A uh, quick hello to my favourite stream peoples. Ali Cat, you're one of my favourite stream people as well. Hope you're doing well. A quick hello suggests that you're not going to be hanging around for too long. Maintenance division. Is this like a workbench? It is. So... Ah, man, that's a that's a lot of wear, huh? And that's how many weapon parts we got. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. I'm in class. I might get the chance to stick around longer a little later. Uh, I'm not too sure how much longer I am going to be. Like, streaming on today, Ali. So, we've just started. We're in the first, like, 15 minutes or something. Uh, but I have convention tomorrow. I'm going to uh, Movie Comic Con London. And I'm getting up at stupid early hours. So, so I can't stream for too long. Otherwise, I'll have uh, approximately zero I sleep. died a couple weeks back. Still ain't past it. I know how you feel. Also, hi Q. How are you doing? Forgot to say hi there. Okay. I'm more interested in helping out Esther here. A, because she's cute. B, because she says that she's going to help people. I've got some time. You do? Good. Thanks. I'll see to it that this medicine gets to the people who need it. Okay. Here. Something for your trouble. Nothing personal, but... I hope we never do business together again. Oh. Don't want to make a habit of consorting with smuggler types. Oh, charm. Hmm. <laughs> you want my silence? You're going to have to buy it? Yikes. I'm not that. I'm not that. Oh, charm. You do have some cheek on you. Lucky for you, I kept a little contingency fee in case you tried to negotiate with me. Oh! I... Yeah. Somebody deserving. Silas, on account of him being out in the cold. Mm. Amelia, seeing how she's around people all the time. Anybody in the sick room? That seems fair. Oh, I'm an actuary. That means I keep tabs on a worker's living expenses. How much it costs to feed, clothe, shelter, bury, and replace your average human worker. Okay. Technically, I'm employed by the Spacious Choice Department of Human Resources. Technically. Well, I'll leave you be. Until another time. Sounds like fun. Are you going to be cosplaying for the con tomorrow? Uh, no. No, not really. I do have plenty of cosplay ideas. Uh, unfortunately, it's sort of my... 
habit, my nature to be a bit perfectionist. So if I don't have a cosplay which I'm happy with wearing, uh, which I think will look good and I feel comfortable in, I'm not going to wear it. So I have done casual cosplay in, uh, in the past before. So the one which I've probably done the best is Gavin uh, Free's GTA character from uh, GTA 5. Like the... Just the always open mouth. I mean, that's an old reference, though, so it's kind of void at this point. Uh, I also might be streaming myself. I actually got some kind of streaming thing set up, so I might just be busy while you're having fun at con, you lucky goose. Well, Ali, uh, good luck with the streaming. Good luck. Hope you have a good one. Now, I didn't come in here the first time. You read the latest report? Only the part that said we ain't making our quotas. If only McDevitt's folk hadn't abandoned us, Tannery could use those extra hands. Nothing we can do about that. Amelia came. Yeah, there is. We can have another zero. Never streamed before, Ali. You're going to be great. I am certain of it. You're going to have a great time. I don't know you. I don't know you. <laughs> yeah, we're going to go with the sass on this one again. So. Uh, to catch everyone up, oh, I hope you have fun at con though. It sounds fun, gotta save up myself, but thank you. I will have fun. I'm going to be uh, seeing Kara Eberly for the first time in like three years. Lady, you look haggard. Uh, just to, to catch everyone up who wasn't here for last stream. So, my actual name is James T. Kirk. Yes, haha, <laughs> in, in game is James T. Kirk. But in order to pass as the new captain of this ship that we acquired acquired because the old captain's dead our drop pod landed on him he's he's dead long story short uh we have now taken up the identity of captain alex hawthorne i don't want to piss off anybody in this town really since i'm new here so i'm just kind of keeping my name out of the picture uh, otherwise i am known as alex james t kirk hawthorne Long name, you can blame my mother. We don't welcome trouble. I don't know what you're about, but this here is a Spacer's Choice drinking establishment. We're all loyal, hardworking company folk here. You know, she's got the same sort of face that I had uh, when I uh, had my dissertation due in uh, two days after my girlfriend cheated and dumped me. Could have fooled me. All I see are a bunch of drunken slobs and one ugly bartender. Yikes. Let's be nice. What a fine establishment it is. You really think so? Yeah. That's kind of you. I've been trying to keep the floors clean. Lovely bar. I have no idea how long it takes to scrub the tiles. Hey, it's good. Don't worry. Hmm. Guess I misreckoned you. Damn right you did. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to be curt. We just got some problems lately. The roasting in the game has already won me over. You'd like. Oh. Gotta ask you to enjoy your beverage within the premises, though. Oh, of course. Can't risk you bringing a drink over to those deserters. You understand. Of course. Those teeth are a little scary. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Let's see what's on tap. Coming right up. Yeah, the, um... Ah... So, yeah, so, Ali, uh, there are some savage answers in this game. Like, you can be literally the asshole of the stars. If you want to. Plain and pure water. How many, how many credits, or how many bits do I have? I have a lot of bits. Not on Twitch, of course, but in-game. But we'll, we'll leave it there. Hi, Winslow. Who are you? Never seen you here before. You a visitor? Welcome. On behalf of the Star Lord, cranked up to fifty. Exactly. Let me welcome you to, to uh, where am I again? I've been, <laughs> I've been asking myself that same question. Oh, I ask myself questions all the time. Oh, same dude. For example, why do we spend money on these fancy latrines when we have a perfectly good wall outside? Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, hey, I think you've had a little too much to drink. Oh, it's fine. I I'm only on my third bottle. I don't start heaving up my guts as long as I can count to three. 
Company lets me imbibe as much zero G brew as I can afford. Good word there, they imbibe. Gave me a discount on account of my injury. You jealous yet? Yep. Got my mitt stuck in a rotor wheel. Shredded my wrist up ah. a little bit. Conrad went and sewed up my hand, but I couldn't do much about the pain. Boss was real generous to me, though. Got myself a 5% discount on Zero G Brew. After the second bottle, the only pain I feel is emotion. Oh, man, what a mood. What a mood. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Conrad's a surgeon. Well, he's a barber. That's like surgery, but for your hair. This town is so messed up. Oh, my goodness me. Can we, can we go back here? Oh, we can. Is it like a bar back here? Oh, this is the, this is the, the rest room. Guess there's not much back there though. Uh, so let's take a little look at my quests. Okay, so now we have to go find the generator. Start a workers' revolution. Dethrone the company. Yes, me and what army? The grease monkey, Argo? I'm sorry. Mr. Thompson, sir, you asked why it's taking so long to fix. The answer's technical. <laughs> Don't apologize. Just try using small words. <laughs> the cans bust open in the oven because she's set to cook saltuna, which isn't what we've got. Mr. Thompson, I think there's someone here to see you. Focus, Miss Holcomb. You and I are still talking. Let's start over. Walk me through the process. Show me where it's going awry. Well, sure. It's uh, mostly on account of what we're feeding into the mechanism. It puts food in cans. We have food, we have cans. Why won't it work like we need? She's expecting Saltuna of a certain size. We're filling the cans with... Well, not fish. You, are you done? You good? Yeah? Okay. Seems we've got a guest. Really now, Parvati, I do wish you'd spoken up. I do apologize. I was given no forewarning of your arrival, or I might have welcomed you at the gates myself. Uh... I'll wait until you're finished. You were saying, Miss Holcomb. It's just what Bess needs is a proper refurbish. I, I, I can bandage her up. Is it people? All, but she's just Who knows? Old. Maybe it's sorry, horse meat. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll do better. And I do wish you'd stop referring to our cannery as Bess. Personification of company property is strictly contrary to the Spacer's Choice Code of... I don't Code. like these Spacer's my Choice apologies. people. I am not in the habit of allowing my guests to witness such a row. Now, what can I do for you? In my Swedish meatballs, James? No, not at all. <laughs> uh... You must be the town boss. I'm Reed Thompson, outpost administrator. I must say, wearing a marauder's outfit is in very poor taste. I do wish you'd show your uniform a little more respect. I forgot that I'm wearing marauder's costume. Yeah. Yes, so it dawns on me. Seems I allowed my excitement to run away with my wits. Been a few seasons since we've had a visitor pass. Very clever though that it picks up that I'm in a Marauder outfit. The only reason I'm in a Marauder outfit is, again, mostly just armor. I'm sticking on whatever's best. Uh, seems like I've been. Uh, my ship needs repairs. I'm looking for a power regulator. The only regulator we got is hooked up to the town transformer. Yikes! Okay. Mr. Thompson ain't liable to be keen on dismantling it. She's cute. Your pardon. I am most uh, emphatically not keen. Hold on there. I can't let you have our power regulator. Ah. But I happen to know of another one. And I happen to know exactly how you may retrieve I love yourself in the I love his facial like expression of but I do know 
where to get another one. Like, <laughs> he's got that, that that little, like, ooh, that, that little eyebrow raise. Uh, okay, I'm gonna get out of here. Have fun at the con. I'm roasting people. Thank you so much, Honey Cat Streamer. Have a great time with your stream tomorrow. Hope you have a good class. Take care. Um, I have to know exactly how you may achieve it without frying yourself in the process. Uh, let's hear it. There's a power regulator in the old botanical lab. It's mostly abandoned, so mostly all that power abandoned. is being squandered. Go down to the geothermal plant. Reroute power from the botanical district over to us. Once their power is shut down, you can have their regulator and be along on your way. Okay. That sounds like a plan. Yeah, when you say mostly abandoned, like that's... <laughs> I was not entirely sure how to tell you this. The botanical labs are not legally inhabited. So marauders. Okay, that's there fine. There are people who live there. That's fine. Uh, what, a, what a surprise. Uh, you mean marauders? Marauders are people. Uh, what a surprise. I never would have guessed. I am not trying to pull one over on Hey, Epic Ninja. How are you doing? You were bound to run into them sooner or later. The people living in the botanical lab. They're deserters. Deserters. Former workers. I need them back at their posts. I need them to come right, home. Right, so now we've got another faction. So we've got the marauders who are kind of like crazy folk. They're basically like uh they're basically like the bandits in Borderlands, from what I understand. You then have the spaces choice folks who are the people who live under these ridiculous laws in, in Edgewater. And then you have the deserters. You sound like my kind of people. If I was in this town, I get out of I get out of there immediately. Uh, try uh, I'm okay. Tried Battlefront two last night. Nice. How did you find it? How did you find it? I'm guessing on PC. Uh, why? Edgewater is struggling. Okay. We haven't hit our production quota in years. If we don't meet our quotas this year, the company might shut us down for good. I need those workers back at their stations. Mm. So it's a case of everyone, like, collectively working together, I guess. I need, like, rights for those workers, though. I, I don't want to be the asshole straight away. Yeah, on PC, I was a bully. Excellent. Glad you had a good time. Yeah, I've seen, I don't blame those walk workers for, for walking out. Sorry, dude. Neither do I. The fault was entirely mine. I pushed them too hard. My hope is that by cutting off their power, you will convince those deserters to come back to town. Before you go to the plant, I want you to stop by the botanical lab. Speak to their leader, Adelaide. Tell her the power's about to go. And that it's time her band of deserters came back to town. You know... He actually, he actually has some common sense about him. Like, he's admitting that he was at fault for the issues. Let's see. Adelaide's older than the other deserters. She's dignified, kindly. From what I understand, her camp looks to her for leadership. Okay. Yeah, what if Adelaide doesn't want to come back? That is not a hypothetical I enjoy entertaining. We need Adelaide back. Nonetheless, I will settle for the return of her followers. We belong to one community, the Spacer's Choice family. If we dissolve into factions, then we will all perish separately. Adelaide will understand that. Okay. My dad told me all about the plant. Taught me all he knew. I could come in useful. I mean, if that's all right with you, Mr. Thompson. Yo, we got a cute girl as our first companion. I hesitate to part ways with Miss Holcomb. But I cannot deny that she Hell is yeah! talented and may prove useful to you. You will need an administrative passcode in order to enter the plant. I am trusting you with mine and trusting Miss Holcomb to guide you if you'd like. I don't need Pavati's help. I can absolutely. Right. I got my wrenches and diagnosticators and hairpins and engine tape, so I'm all set. Hell yeah. Well, I am glad to hear that. Only did Best Ewok hunt and Galactic and Assault. Again for your help. There's a lot of good modes in there. To ask of a stranger, I know. Yo, dude, you've you've let me stroll into your town and ask for a power regulator, and you've been like super accommodating. I think he's actually the most stand-up bloke that we know. 
Pavati can now join the party. Awesome. You have gained a new companion. They are characters that join you in your adventures and help in a variety of ways. Ba ba da ba ba da ba ba da. Oh, so I can give her my weapons. Interesting. Do I have any better armor for you? The answer's no, but you could have a helmet. Had a game where I started as an Ewok and got eight kills. Ewok Hunts uh, recently had a a retool as well, from what I understand. Uh, to deliver a message to a woman. So we want to do that one now. Cool. Right, uh, let's go. We better clear out of Mr. Thompson's office before we talk. What sniper would you recommend using? Uh, the... Hey, mister, oh. can we talk? Yeah, of course. Sorry. The IQA? Can we chat? Yeah. Sorry. I... You just want to get out of here. And you likely don't want to tag along like me. What? It's just... Mr. Thompson has his own view on matters. On account of it's his job and, and what all, but... That's not the only side of the tale. Okay. Uh, what do you seem to seem pretty straightforward to me? Sure, it all comes together seamless in his own head. And I reckon he means well, for all that. It's just, he doesn't always get where other folk are talking from. To Mr. Thompson, a person's a gear. It does its job quiet-like. I could see that. If it squeaks or stutters, it gets replaced. The deserters are decent folk. I knew some of them before they left. Uh, can't blame anybody for wanting you to leave. Yeah, this town's got issues. Life's hard here. Especially for them that don't fit in so well. We're one big Spacer's Choice family, but every family's got the one the rest... I locked that last night. It's a good sniper. Good sniper. Mr. Thompson's aiming to take away their power. They'll have no lights to see, nor heat to cook. They'll be at the mercy of marauders, or worse. I think you should talk to the town's vicar about it. Max, his name is. Okay. Uh, yeah, what a funny... The mission's on the east side of town. You can't miss it. On account of it being the only clean thing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, I suppose good. Huh? We can stop by. Thanks, mister. I just think when you gotta make a decision that'll hurt somebody, it's best to think on the right and wrong of it. Agreed. That's what my dad used to say anyways. You know, Pavati, I like your way of thinking. I uh, still don't know which special units I like. I am a big fan of the... Uh, the Imperial... Like the Death Guard. Wookiee's pretty fun. I am enjoying the Clone Commando. The Droidica's pretty amazing. Both of those two latter ones are, are relatively new. On the east side of town. So I'm guessing that's north, right? Come on, Vati. Let's go. I just snipe for like five or ten minutes and play as hero villains for the rest of the game. Yeah, I, I don't I don't spend much time as heroes or villains, honestly. I enjoy getting involved in the firefight.
way in a second. Vicar Max is in there. I thought he was in the town. I like running in and out of the battlefield. And then it's understandable why you like heroes and villains. How are you liking this game so far? I mean, in total, I've only played, what, one to two hours? But it has been very enjoyable. I, I'm a big, big fan of the look of it. Sean isn't doing an evil run either. You can get Sorry. super duper like evil and assholey too, too clean better check me out in bed hey then there, sister <laughs> Don't see you around here too often oh i just came to talk to the vicar is all none of us are above confessionals what have you got to confess you ain't thinking of deserting are you what no 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 and i resent the accusation wasn't nothing but a question. Do excuse me. I must be on my way. Verity to you. Hello, Vicar Max. Yes, what is it? You're an outsider. Fantastic. Vicar Maximilian de Soto at your service. Or Vicar Max, if you're the sort who prefers brevity. And Ms. Holcomb as well. How rare to see you out, and with a complete stranger. Curious. Just tagging along, Vicar DeSoto. I like oh, that mind. he's like... I so rarely get new people to talk to. Name your poison, anything at all. Spiritual counseling, this season's tossball predictions, the quickest way out of town. I like this guy. I love, it's a small detail. It's a really small detail, but... For a face-to-face -face conversational uh, system like this, the fact that he's looking at me, as I do you right now, but then when he's talking to another character, he's looking off-screen to the character that's over there and not towards you because you're there and she's there. I think that's brilliant. I don't think I've ever seen that in a game before. Can you bully the next person you talk to after this for me? Only if it justifies it. Uh. Yeah, how do you know I'm an outsider? I've never seen you before. And there's been no paperwork indicating a transfer. Half the time it's wrong, but a new worker without paperwork? Unheard of. Also, you lack the distinctive worker gaze. <laughs> Usually either a deadening behind the eyes, or in some rare cases... A wild-eyed frenzy, like a trapped animal. Pretty universal here. Except for Ms. Holcomb, who, for some reason, doesn't seem to have much to say to me. Isn't that right? It's just... There's more to it all than numbers. Sorry. Hey, uh, let's get back on track. What would you like to discuss? But what? I thought you would talk to him. You wanted to speak to me, Ms. Holcomb? Every time I've tried to engage you in conversation, you look at the floor, answer in single words, and slink oh, away. Oh, she seems so lovely. I can't imagine lovely. what would be so grave as to drive her to my mission. What has Mr. Thompson asked you to do? Yeah. Depriving them of safety from the marauders and wildlife. I can see why that troubles you. Miss Holcomb has a soft heart. Always has, if you believe the talk. Yeah, what do you think about the latest group? 
They rejected the order of society and live beyond the walls so thoughtfully provided by our Spacer's Choice patrons. Oh, he's a bit stuck up himself. Does that strike you as a responsible life choice? I mean... Oh, we can't use intelligence. Yeah, so what do you advise? Assuming your goal is to save as many as possible, then you should bring everyone together. Send the power to Edgewater and convince the deserters to return to the fold. Just talk everybody into coming together. I'll keep that in mind. If it were as easy as a few soothing words in the right ears, I'm sure it would have been done already. Consider it a challenge. If you don't mind a bit of unsolicited advice, be cautious on your way to the geothermal plant. It is not as safe as you might assume. No worries. Happiness. I'm not impressed. And I can handle myself better than a vicar? I mean, yeah. <laughs> the marauders I met when I ventured outside the walls might agree with you. Bastard snuck up on me while I was dutifully Stay hydrated, for a don't worry, I will. collector's library. Barely escaped with my life. But you see, one of the reasons I transferred here was to get my hands on that heretical text. If you managed to acquire it for me, I'd pay quite a handsome sum for the book. Okay. And why would a vicar be after a banned heretical book? I just want to keep the writing out of layman's ah. hands. It wouldn't do hey, so for how you information doing? to fall into public consumption. Yeah, you make a Glad we see eye to eye. 